Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how you can grab the YouTube automatically generated closed captions or subtitles from a YouTube video. So the first thing you need to do is open up the YouTube video. Second thing, hit the play button. Of course it will probably automatically play, but then you'll want to hit the pause button so it pauses. Next, you can right click anywhere on the page. Inspect the element. This thing pops up, you're going to go over here to the network tab. When you click that, you'll see stuff start populating here. What you want to do then is click on this CC button. You might have to click it a couple times till it pops up. You'll see a new one here pop up called Timed Text. Right click on that, open that baby up in the new tab. Here are your subtitles right here. Now, you can either go ahead and select all this manually because Control A and Control C doesn't work or you can go ahead and hit File, Save As, and just save it as a uh, whatever you want to do. So we'll save it as create Facebook page or just Facebook. Let's see. And you hit save. Next thing you're going to do is open that up with uh, an application, probably Adobe Dreamweaver. You can go ahead and hit control A and control C on that. Now if you don't have Dreamweaver, you're going to have to manually copy all of that information from your file right here within your web browser. Okay, Then you're going to go over here to XL. You're going to highlight one cell, paste it there. Now you're going to hit Command or Control F, which is the Find button. So Find. Now you're going to type in the left caret, then Shift 8 or a little star, and then the right caret replace replace with now this is crucial hit the space bar button that way you'll have a space between all of your words replace all replace that many instances it's done now you can close this now if you copied all that you won't have to do this next step but if you used a program and selected it from there like Dreamweaver with an HTML program then you're gonna have to replace any spot where you need an apostrophe with this that has this code in there so you just copy that code command F paste in that code it's and number 39 then a semicolon you'll replace that with your apostrophe replace all close now you can go ahead and hit controller command A controller command C and you'll copy all that you're gonna paste it right into a text edit to remove all the formatting and the cells copy that then you can either paste this into a search bar however Chrome and Firefox recently released an update that now you cannot paste big long text into that so you have to use this new thing called just paste it it's pretty cool you just paste it in there and uh, it has no formatting and it puts all the spaces back in there it takes away all the entrances now you can just copy that out of there and put it right in your Word document and there you go. Now you just need to do a little spell check and you have your subtitles completely extracted from your YouTube video.